Hello, this is Jeff from Vocal Boost to Go. Today I want to show you how to turn the closet into voiceover booth. For full disclosure, I don't do the voiceovers. I do voiceover booths for people who do voiceovers. So for this example, we chose this closet. Ta-da! It's a pantry. So the first thing you need to do is throw everything out of here. So now, once we finished unloading everything from the closet, uh, we're gonna put the voiceover booth in there. So this is the setup I was going for. Uh, the small desk, there is a little niche because this closet is 36 inches wide and uh, the computer. The problem is it's impossible to record here. And we're going to try to make a sample before and after. You can hear all that ringing, all that echo. We got to take care of that. We need to eliminate it. And uh, we're gonna do it using acoustic panels and acoustic blankets. We're gonna line up the whole thing with the roof and we'll show how it is. So now we cleaned everything out over here. We can leave those top shelves and they're just gonna still serve as a storage. And what we're gonna do, we will put uh, beams over here all around and from that we will suspend the blankets and uh, we're gonna create the roof on top. So to save on wood, we're gonna go and cut some planks from here. So we're gonna find some wood over here, the one that's more or less straight, and that's what we're gonna use. All right. This will do, this will do. So what we're gonna do, well, it's a little blemished, but it's okay. Uh, what we're gonna do, we're gonna put this bar over here, like that. And then we're gonna put another one over here. So now we attach the bar over here and the other bar on the opposite side. So this allows us to hang the blanket and have about two, three inches from the wall to the blanket, which is the best way to do it. Now for the roof, we're gonna use another blanket and we use these bars, which go on this part of the closet and on the other side, and it's just gonna create the support for the roof blanket. So we're gonna have blankets on three walls like that and this wall will have panels. Uh, for the panels, we're gonna use this beautiful one and we're just gonna put it right there on the side and even now you can hear the voice is different. So now we put the blankets over here and uh, the desk is back in. Now the desk is still reflective surface so we're gonna use this acoustic panel and it's soft. So I'm just gonna put it right on the desk, just like this. So this will block all the reflections from the desk itself. I can still have the use of the bottom drawer if I need to, but that's it. And now here we're gonna put acoustic panels. Um, something for me to look at so i don't feel like in a closed box all the time so now i'm going to put the pin about a couple of inches off of that and i'm going to start like that in the middle pull it all the way through so it's ready and i'm going to do the same on the other side couple of inches off the mark just like that Okay, 
Now I'm gonna push it in right above my desk. Now here we attach the screws and we're going to support the blanket. After you hang the blankets, to hang the roof first hook up some grommets on the edge and after that we just use these planks and going to put it across just like that. So now we finished converting pantry into the voiceover studio. And uh, this is the outside blanket that hangs all the way from the ceiling down to the floor. So this is the outside blanket. So we have the first layer and there is an inside blanket for better insulation, the second layer. Now we're gonna get in. And you can see the roof. All right, so this is the booth. Now, once we set it everything up, I have these acoustic panels in front of me. That looks good. And I love the mountains. So I have uh, the microphone. I have the uh, little clip lights. This is my computer. This is the uh, interface. To hang the light, you can use this high-tech equipment and just run it over like this. And then the other one here. Once you uh, attach those rubber bands, you simply hang it to the nails over here, to the screws. And you're done. So here, I have the fan speed controller, so I can turn it on and the fan starts blowing. If I need to reduce the volume, I can just turn it down. So it blows air inside the booth and then I can just turn it off. So now we're going to try to record some samples. One, one, one. I can hear the ringing in the walls. And you can see how sharp it is. And you can see this right, there's no echo over here. No echo. One, one, one. One, one, one.
And now I'm gonna do some reading. The tale of modern life is mixed. From laser surgery to genetic engineering, science has produced astonishing advances. But modernization is also a story of traditional cultures eroding beneath the swift currents of change. The tale of modern art life is mixed. From laser surgery to genetic engineering, science has produced astonishing advances. But modernization is also a story of traditional cultures eroding beneath the swift currents of change.